Hey guys, we are back at it again with another Twitch VOD. This one is from the 27th of March, 2022. This is a bit of a shorter stream as I was still recovering from my final dental surgery and we played Chef Squad. Chef Squad. It was great fun. Really good. Like lots of chat interaction and stuff like that. So if you would like to catch us live, you can do so over at twitch.tv forward slash Fiamma. You can add a slash schedule onto the end of that to see what we're going to be streaming and when converted very conveniently to your time zone. If you're feeling extra generous today, you can drop me a follow on Instagram. I would really, truly appreciate it. The link is down in the description box, along with links for my Twitter, TikTok, and Facebook as well. Hopefully you enjoy this VOD, and I will see you in chat next time. Yes, good. Button worked. Fantastic. Hello. Excuse me. Oh my goodness. Don't eat marshmallows and milk. Apparently it makes you burp. <laughs> Hi. Hello, hello. Um, I hurt. <laughs> I do still hurt. Um, my voice is still a little bit rough. Not nearly as bad as it was yesterday, which is which is great news. Uh, but it's it's definitely still uh, a bit of a pain in the ass. Um, getting there. Getting there. I I just hope that this will Shit. not um utterly destroy what progress I've made in healing. Um, who is keen to play some Chef Squad? Um, I will just double check. Uh, I think that's all fine. I think we're all good. Let me just double check. Yeah, I think we're I think we're good. Awesome. Just wanna make sure because I had this scene set up from last time we played, but I wasn't sure if I'd tweaked anything for anything else. I wasn't hundred percent, so I wanted to make sure that everything was gonna be where it was gonna be. And uh and be fine. Um This is the first time I'm speaking today, really. Uh, I think I've said maybe three or four words throughout the day, trying to preserve my voice, because this is going to be fun. But uh, we will we will see how we go. Uh, and I hope that you are all very excited. I hope you're all very excited to stress me the fuck out. Now to many anatomy lessons! Me too. I love that. I love that. Well done. Well done. No, um, the ulcers and stuff seem to be, like, they look gnarly. They look a lot worse than they did on Friday. Like, they look a lot worse. Um, but I think it's because they've kind of, all of them have sort of grown and merged into each other, so now it's just kind of this massive cream-coloured nastiness. But, um, they don't hurt as much as they did, so I think they're on track to heal or to be healing it just really sucks and this jaw is like grinding and clunking like a piece of 1960s machinery like i kid you not it's absolutely terrible um so i don't know what's going on there but i will ask them tomorrow how my check up i have no doubt they're gonna stare down my throat for a little while um but look, i uh surviving. I, I realized, finally, I realized yesterday that my mouse is wireless, so I could control Netflix from bed. I have to get up every time it said, if asked if I wanted to continue watching. I could just like grab my, my mouse and pop on my leg and click the thing and then toss it aside again. <laughs> can't believe it took me that long to figure that out, but um, I think it was probably because I was on drugs. We are. Uh, okay. Uh, well done, Zam, on Fursi. Well done, Shiva, with first. Uh, Desi has missed out on Fursi, unfortunately. Zam grabbed it out from under you. Hello, Kat. Uh, hey, Zarin. Feeling a little better, at least? Look, I am. Honestly. Honestly, I am. I'm feeling... I'm really run down and really tired and just... Ugh. But I definitely feel like I'm on the tail end of it. I feel like this is my body now kicking into gear to repair. Rather, because you know, you know, like you know, when you when you have a war that's going on, 
at first there's damage and there's there's things to fight and everyone's firing at each other and it's all fighting and rah and fire and explosions and all the kind of horrible stuff, right? And then the fighting stops. But you've got to repair and rebuild everything. Everything that got damaged. So I feel like I've been sick enough, which is horrible, that I can feel my body shifting in repair mode, into repair mode which is good, so um, it means it's obviously it's going to heal the surgery side, it's going to hopefully heal up those ulcers. Um, I've got a lot of talking to do this week, not just because of stream, but I have like so many medical appointments this week. <laughs> so um, I'm, I'm hoping that like, I'm hoping it'll be okay. And yeah, I've got my, my follow-up with the surgeon tomorrow. Uh, a week. It's been one week since surgery as of tomorrow, so um, he's going to have a poke around and Excuse me, have a look at the um have a look at the, the surgery site and, and my scans that I had done on Friday and just make sure that everything's where it should be. And uh, fingers crossed I'm golden. I sorry, I was laughing because um I have marshmallows because they're soft and tasty and and nice and stuff. But then I also have um cinnamon bun flavoured milk. This stuff is the fucking bomb. It is the bomb. So when I'm burping, it tastes like cinnamon marshmallows, and I'm so not angry at this. I'm so not angry at this. Um, and I'm headphoned up to ready to type. Oh, I'm so pleased, Mini. I'm so glad to hear that. So glad to hear that. Watch and stress with you. Oh, no, cat. You're supposed to have fun. I will stress. You can have fun at the expense of my stress. Hopefully you feel better soon. Uh, hello, Kay. Welcome on in. Hello, Rins. That is still, of course. Yeah, look, I've had friends do that. It's they're not worth it. They're genuinely just not even worth. Like, um, yeah, look, the 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 times that it has happened to me, and I've kind of looked back on how my relationship has like been with that person it's always kind of felt like I was on eggshells or like that I was always doing something just not quite right or that I that I smelled bad or something like that. And I realized eventually that they were just waiting, waiting, waiting for me to do something that they could use to justify ending the relationship because they didn't want to be there anymore. As in like friend really, because friendship is a type of relationship, right? So, and it's like, and so, you know, it, it, it seems like this little tiny thing, but from their perspective, it was the one thing that they were waiting for to be able to use as an excuse to get out, which honestly is really sad. Like, I, I really wish that we could be in a world where people can communicate these kind of things. Like, you know, being able to sit down with someone and say, hey, look, you haven't, you're not, you're not doing anything wrong. You're not a terrible person. I don't, I don't hate you or anything like that, but... We just, we don't really have much in common, you know, where we seem to travel in the same friendship groups and stuff, but I just don't vibe with you. And so, I mean, I'm happy to be civil with you and, and all that kind of stuff, but, um, you know, you, these, these kind of catch-ups and stuff, I'm just, I'm really not interested in doing that. Could, maybe could we not pursue that and direct our energies elsewhere and then just when we're in the same places, just be civil to each other. Like, I have no problem with that communication would be awesome and I could just be like hey there you know how are you how's life great awesome cool I'm gonna go talk to other people now and that's the extent of how much I would interact with those people it would just be so much less pressure on both of us to kind of put on the happy face or pretend like we've got things that fuck that life's too short so yeah look it's um it's so not worth spending the energy on that kind of stuff far better off spending energy on people who value and your contributions to the relationship um, but that's just my two cents and my 32 years of losing friends. <laughs> I'm quite opinionated and so, you know, people like to put me up on shit. Um, but uh, there, there have been a few people who I just haven't gotten along with for whatever reason. And, and yeah, they've decided to explode it rather than just letting it fizzle out. And it's like, we're okay. Do you boo? And some people also thrive on the drama, of course. Like, we all know that. Some people can't live without something being dramatically wrong. Um, so, so, that's also a thing. But that's okay. Um, where are we? Uh, let me show you look after a second. Oh, I have. I spent all of yesterday in bed. Um, I have been resting like a lot. So, don't, don't worry. Um, definitely resting. 
I don't know if she was going well so far. Oh, you're only like a couple minutes late, dude. We've only, we've just been talking. We've just been catching up on chat. Uh, better than fart burps. So much better than fart burps. Holy cow. Like, miles better than fart burps. Like, are you feeling better? A little bit. My throat doesn't hurt as much as it did. I can drink water now. <laughs> water doesn't feel like razors. Um, but milk is definitely, like, milk has been better. Um, this is cine cine bun flavored milk. It's it's cinnamon bun flavored milk, and it's... Uh -huh. like, cinnamon is my favorite thing, and so cinnamon flavored milk is just delicious. It's like cinnamon and vanilla, you know, sweetened and cinnamon. Um, I think she reminds me of the songs from Bob's Burgers. Amazing. You might you might, might have to jump in and, and be Bob. Bob, you'll have to, or TK, you'll have to jump in and be Bob with us. Oh, no, cat. I'm so sorry to hear that. Uh, is it time to chop slap? Yes. Correct. It is Katie. It's okay. Those people that I see at the stage do we have us? Oh, it's totally fine, Katie. You're definitely not one of those people. Bastards, I know, a bunch of mustards. That's kind of people. A good sign. Yeah, yeah. Um, it certainly doesn't hurt nearly as much. There's still, like, it's still not good. Like, it's still not a pleasant experience. <laughs> um, but it's it's a hell of a lot better. Um, and I I fully expect that by the end of stream it'll hurt again. Um, but I'll be I'll be alright. Um, yeah, it's yeah. I'm I'm definitely on the end, and I'm I'm very pleased about that. On the end. Uh, it is amazing. Agreed. Agreed. Okay. Um, we're gonna play. Yeah, absolutely. It is. Absolutely. Um, we're gonna watch the tutorial video just in case there are a handful of people here who didn't play this with us last time or who haven't played it before. Um, we will of course go through little bits and pieces as people need it, like, as we go, but, um, just for all of you who are here and ready to chef it up with me, uh, let's learn how, and let's learn how to play. So we want, no, we want more, we want more. Um, we, like, we had some gay, like, we had some rounds last time we streamed, uh, towards the end where we only had, like, a couple of people, and good lord, it sucked. It was really, really hard. The more people, the better. Um, genuinely, uh, but we'll see how we go. Hi, I'm one of Julia, and welcome to Chef Squad. In Chef Squad, players work together to run a restaurant. The streamer plays as the head chef, and chat plays as chefs in the kitchen. Finish the day to unlock new foods, upgrades, and challenges. Oh, <gasps> sandwich! The kitchen has a number of stations based on what's on the menu. Each station can prepare specific ingredients. When the day starts, the streamer should drag a chef from the chef pool onto a station and tell that player what to do. April, let's do some hot dogs. Please, regular, and Molly, let's do some vegan hot dogs. If you're unsure what to make, type exclamation point which one, and the streamer can help you out. When you're on a station, type the ingredient to select it and then follow the instructions that pop up to finish preparing it. Once you've finished, the ingredient will be added to the inventory and your chef will be placed back into the chef pool. If Twitch chat prevents you from typing the key phrase, try typing any word after the command to bypass the filter. Should a player need to be kicked at any time for being AFK, the streamer can right click that chef and do so. Orders will come in on the right side and will have specific ingredients needed to make them. Everyone needs to work together to make ingredients for each order. A check mark on the ingredient indicates it's been made and is ready to go. And a clock indicates an ingredient is currently being made. Focus on making ingredients without these symbols and ingredients with zero inventory. Once the order is ready, it will have a large check mark next to it. The streamer should place a chef on a final order station near the top of the screen to finalize an order and send it out to the customer. If an order runs off the screen, it becomes a bad order. Get too many bad orders and your day is over. No! I believe in the power of the squad and I know we can all do it together. Good luck, chefs. So we failed one day. Last time we were playing, we had, I think, one day that we failed. So we did pretty well. Um, congrats. Very round. It's um, what I was telling you, Krasi, don't chase them. 
Like, <laughs> if anyone is still trying to get flying, do not try to chase rares as they pop up. It is the worst idea possible. Pick one and camp it. The, the rares have really short respawns, in, like not, not like two to three minutes, but they've got respawns that are usually under half an hour if they're actually spawning that day. There are a couple that don't spawn on certain days, but if you stand at one and you just wait there and you have a look through your group finder and look for people who are actually putting those groups together, there are less groups being put together now, but those those rares will pop up like within the kind of half hour. Um, it's, it's far from impossible, you just need a very, very different strategy now, that's all. Um, but yeah, that would be definitely my advice, is to just literally pick one and camp it. Your flying always sucks, at least it's easier than it was in BFA Legion and Lord. Uh, I disagree that it always sucks personally, but that's just my experience with the game. I, I really enjoyed unlocking flying every single time it's been there. It's all stuff that I would normally do anyway. Like doing world quests and finishing off questing and going and exploring and, and you know ex opening up the map and all that kind of stuff that's all stuff that I would do normally um, so it's I've never had to go out of my way to get flying um, that's okay. you did a night fair totally fair all right guys let's now that we've watched that we're gonna play Uh, yeah, that's me. There we go. What should we cook today? Uh, okay, so I need to pick one. Uh, for group, no one is on. Fair. Look, hey, there's, there's benefits and drawbacks to every time of day and night, ain't there? Alright, um, so I am going to choose soup because it's all I've been able to eat for most of this week. Soup and soup-related goods. Um, so what you guys can do is type your choice. Type what you would like to vote for. Exclamation hot dog or exclamation chicken or lasagna or whatever you would like. Vote for what you would like to put on the menu. I like bread's not on the menu yet, I don't think. Thank you. Oh, it's so squishy! Secret way of making I like bread squishy. Thank you. Cast your votes. Alright, so we're doing lasagna, pizza, and soup. Okay. What we're gonna do, you need to type exclamation hire me once this opens. So once you see this open, type exclamation hire me in chat and you'll have 60 seconds to enter. Time to squad up. So there you go. 60 seconds. Exclamation hire me if you would like to join us for this round. And it'll pop up on screen once it's registered you. fantastic it's good fun I promise it's not it's not as stressful as it looks because all, as long as you guys focus on exactly what you're meant to be doing like just your job and then wait for you to come up again and then focus on your job and then da 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 it's really good anyone else would like to join us need a few more chefs to make this not super duper painful <laughs> Uh, Jimmy, it is Chef Squad, exclamation hire me to join in. Uh, it's played by viewers in chat. Okay, so I have bots. Suit up and head out. Alright. Um, you can choose what you would like your appearance to look like. You can type exclamation and then a letter to pick one of the six sprites, and then a number to pick a skin tone. So you can see there, bot one and two have done Q6 and R6 to choose. Q and R, and then both of them are skin tone number six. Um, so up to you. If you would like to customize, otherwise you'll be randomized. Your call. Alrighty. 
So here's how to play. When you're placed at a table, type into chat exclamation followed by the three letters for an ingredient listed next to the table. So for, um, uh, for example, if I put you up here and ask for pizza crust, you've got PCT. If I put you up here and ask for thin crust, you've got TCT. So you type those into chat. Uh, and then yeah, Tom is one of the ones for tomato that's behind here. Uh, order counter and chore station will automatically tell you what to type. Some more commands you can use during the game. You can use exclamation which one if you're a bit confused. Exclamation cancel if you picked the wrong one. So for example, if you typed in PCT but you were meant to do TCT, you go, ah crap, exclamation cancel and then exclamation TCT to put the right one in. Uh, and you can quit. If you at any point need to go and do something IRL, instead of leaving yourself in queue to screw us over, because if I place you and then you don't make the ingredient that I've asked you for, it, the time is still running and we'll fall behind. So if you need to step away at any time, exclamation quit will pull you out of the game so that the rest of us can continue um, knowing that you're not going to be there. Already stressed? It's not that hard. It's, it's really not that hard. Um, if you're recovering well after your surgery. I am, Matt. I, I had some complications, but I'm, I'm getting there. Um, so yeah, I've got a, a check up with the surgeon tomorrow and hopefully that goes really well. So yeah. Alrighty. Meaty is up first, followed by Cat, and then Theron, and then a bot that I have to run. So, what surgery? Dental surgery. I've been talking about it for the last six months. <laughs> I have an implant in my jaw. Alright, here we go. Okay, so Meaty, I'm going to get you to do a pizza crust. Cat, if I could get you to do a thin crust, TCT. Uh, Theron, if you could do some lasagna sheets, PLR. Uh, and I'll get the bot there and... Chefs, we have the easier it is. Got one stuff that needs doing. Disgusting. Mushroom. Cat cheese. Cat. Wait. All right, that wasn't cat. That was Hi, the sun cat. Cat can serve up top. Uh, Meaty can do a thin crust. Is that quiz? Thank you so much for the resub. Much appreciated. Uh, Theron, if you could do cheese for me. Nice! Stay complete! Let's wrap it up, squad! Okay! Tomato from cat, please. If we could get tomato, that's T O M. Shoot. 
Another day completed. Brilliant. We got there. We got there. Nothing so, we can't handle. Great squad? Oh, God. Trash has got a lot harder to finish. So I'm fairly sure it means they put in a couple of extra steps. Like, you got to type in more stuff to, to make it happen. Um, ah, and there you go. I forgot about that. You can type in random when you're customizing your chef. If you don't want to pick a, a sprite and a skin tone, you can just type in random. And it'll, funnily enough, randomize it for you. Um, alrighty. So. What should we cook today, squad? Question. We haven't unlocked anything here. Um, let's go hot dogs because it's the only level two one. All right, vote for what we're going to cook. Uh, you can use exclamation and then whichever of the words that are over each of the different panels to choose uh, what you would like us to have on the menu today. Excuse me. Um, so I picked one and it'll go with the top two votes from you. It's, it's it's not that like it's not that big a deal like it's just a game take a breath like honestly it's it's not that bad um one thing i would recommend is checking your settings on the video player um there's a little cog that would be down on this side for you guys if you click that cog and go into advanced and have a look at the video stats and have a look at what your buffer size and latency to streamer is um because if it's taking if it feels like it's taking too long to recognize your command um, it might be because you're lagging. Um, if you're if you're lagging, like, because uh, I'm looking at my thing, I'm all good. Got no drop frames. My my bit rate's excellent. Everything's perfect. Um, so if you are lagging on your end, uh, then it obviously will. Um, yeah, it'll it'll take a second for you to see on stream that it has registered it. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's one thing that could cause issues. But beyond that. Um, I missed what we're actually having because I was talking too much. Good. Mm hmm Let's go, squad. Exclamation, hire me. If you would like to cook with us. Actually, shut down to sneak. Mm. This is one it this is not one of those video games that you can kind of play in the background. This is one that's actually yeah, you gotta you gotta pay some attention. chefs we have, the easier it is on everyone. <laughs> hmm. Hey, Welcome in. Alright, so we have a bot. That's not too out. bad. three bots that I had at one round last stream and it was just ridiculous. It was really, really bad. <laughs> really difficult to figure out what the hell I was supposed to be doing. But that's okay. Customize your chefs if you so desire. 
Um, you can type another one and to override it. Cap. Okay. So you just gotta do it within the timer. Alrighty. <clears throat> Let's go. K is up first. So K, I'll get you to do a T-bone. Meaty can do a rib. Cat can do a patty. B can do a double patty. And I'm gonna hold the bot for a second. Bot can do a tomato. I need a vegan hot dog. That's okay. <clears throat> and the body can do hot dog. Uh, v, I got had you doing a double padding. That's a two pat. You missed it. Uh, K, I will get you to do onion, please. Yep, double patty, thank you. Um, me too, I'll get you doing onion as well. Mushroom. Uh, cat, I'll get you doing lettuce. So, uh, K, I'll get you doing mushroom. Oh. That's odd. Uh, Media, I'll get you doing trash. Perfect. Uh, hopefully, the bottle picked cheese this time around. B. Get you. Get you. Serve that one for us. Um, K, I'll get you doing a regular dog, hot dog. Uh, and Cat can serve. Squad? Yeah, um, I, yeah, we need more chefs. If, uh, yeah, it's, it's, we just, we don't have enough. Um, I might try what to should we cook today? bump up the, um, number of chefs and see if I can get a couple more bots, but I'm not sure that's gonna do it. Um, we need more people playing, or there might be an issue with lag and stuff. Definitely, as I said before, check your player stats, like your, your video stats on the on the Twitch player. Because um, if it lags too much, like if you've got a 30 second or a 60 second delay, the rounds are only three minutes long. Um, so it's gonna suck <laughs> if you've got a terrible connection to Twitch. Um, But that's fine. If you type it wrong, you can immediately type it incorrectly. You've just got to make sure you read, like, once it sends, just double check that you've got the right thing. Because uh, if you sit there waiting for two minutes for the next one and it's not coming up, then there's going to be a reason for it. Um. The... Hang on, what was that? Oh, right, okay. Let's bump it up to... 
six and just see if I can handle the bots. Well, hopefully we get enough God. chefs. Hopefully we get enough people. Jump on in, exclamation hire me to join us. How amazing is this music to send? Last time I was singing along, but my throat hurts entirely too much to hit those high notes. Uh huh. It is absolutely amazing. Oh, indeed. Okay, anyone else want to join us? About 15 seconds to go. Jas is. Uh, exclamation hire me. Last chance. Alrighty, so we've got a couple bots. Cheap up and ship out. Uh, customize your chef if you would like to. Up to you. do some pasta sheets. This here is going to do a pizza crust. K is going to do a thin crust. Meaty is going to do a hot dog. And we'll get the bots. I had to grab those. Serving, yep. Mmm, tasty. Uh, cat, can I get you doing pepper? So the capsicum. Excellent. Oh no! Some people doing the wrong ones. 
if you don't hear what I say, you can uh, you can type in exclamation which one. Uh, tomato for you, okay? Please. You can type in like which one, and I can repeat what I was saying. Um, Squad, no! Yeah, this is. <laughs> up top cat for you serving. And to see a serving as well. I think we had a couple of parts there where I was like, yes, do this one, and then it ended up being a different one, and so we didn't get the ingredient done in time, so it failed. Go squat! Um, that's okay, just yeah, if- I know- I know my throat is rough as hell at the moment, I- I totally get it. Yeah, if- if you mishear me or you're not sure, or you're not 100% sure, just ask. Um, I'm basically assigning, like, left to right as we go down the- the list of food down the side here as well. Um, so, if you match up the- the symbol that hasn't got a thing on it yet to the mm, symbol along tasty. here. Um, yeah. Hmm. Another day completed. Alrighty. Hmm. What do you think, Ooh. Squad? Okay, you gotta vote. So do you wanna unlock nachos or pasta? So exclamation nachos or exclamation pasta in chat. And this is unlocking a totally new menu item. Totally new. We haven't made this before. So depending on what you would like to unlock, pop it in chat. Whichever one gets the most votes, go ahead. <laughs> Very love for the nachos. Mm, I've had so much bad, like so many bad nachos. But I've had, like, very, very little bad pasta. Um, yeah. Nachos are, like... They're just, they're not... They're not compared to pasta. Pasta wins every time for me. Every time. But that was your decision, so there you go. Okay. Next day. Pasta today. Nice. I had what lots we of pasta cook today, last squad? week. Overcooked pasta, specifically. We will unlock everything eventually. Um, I want to choose pasta because I want to see what it's like to cook. Some awesome nachos. Oh, that's really good to hear. Yeah, no, I, um, like, nachos for me, they're either, like, there are parts of it that aren't covered in anything and so they get burnt, um, or they're just, they dry out because of the oven, obviously, and so they get really hard and crunchy, almost to the point that they're stale. Um, and the top ones are loaded with toppings, but the bottom ones are essentially just plain hot corn chips. Like... You know, you gotta like layer that shit, but then if you do layer it and you get it hot enough, then it makes the bottom ones, like it makes them soggy, so it, you know, it just, there are so many ways to bugger up nachos, and pasta is like a lot harder to get wrong, in my opinion. But, that's just me. It's just me, I've got the ingredient choices. I like it, media, I like it. Alright, here we go. Exclamation hire me. In chat, if you want to be a part of this chaotic, the coatic kitchen, if you will. Love to have you all on board. The more people we have, the easier it is on each individual as well. The more time you get to breathe between assignments. Hmm. The coassie mate. It's super cute. I like it a lot. <laughs> mm. Nicole, it's you rubbing your hands. Well, hopefully you'll be typing fast enough to keep you warm. Ship up and ship out. Choose your customizations if you so desire, or you can, of course, you can do exclamation random. Your ship here. It's a dress. It has no pockets, but it's gorgeous and I like it a lot. Okay, 
tickets from um, Wild Bangerang before they lost the Blizzard contract. It's all, um, Sylvanas has got like the feathers and everything done, not like attached, they're all printed. Um, but yeah, I like it a lot. Okay, let's get cracking. Still print for no pockets? Yeah, it's, but that's okay. Uh, all right, meaty, broth, cat, T-bone, Desir, rib, and V on pasta, please. <clears throat> I'm probably gonna do cheese and broccoli. Perfect. Uh, so meaty, that was the broth. Or it might be chicken broth. It's the yellow one. Um, to see if you can do broccoli for us. Uh, or can do trash. Once to see has chosen the broccoli, I can put the other bot on the onion. Otherwise, the bot will override it. There we go. So we've got onion and cheese. Perfection. So the way that the bots work is they give you three seconds and then they pick whatever's next on the list. It hasn't been done yet, which is why I have to make sure go, that you guys go. are on top of your shit so that they don't steal it out from under you. It's fun. Fun as heck. Um, all right, V, I'll get you on tomato and meaty on the sink, unfortunately. Um, Sia, I'll get you on a T-bone. What's on the other? Ouch! We just lost a recipe. I'll get you on pepper, the, so pepper, the um, capsicum. V is on order up. Oh no, squad. Meaty, if I could get you to serve. Another day completed. Um, now is a good time to refresh the page if you are having some latency issues. Like if it's taking a while for your order, like when you type it in, if it's taking a while for it to refresh, like I'm talking 10 seconds or more, um, then maybe hit the refresh button because it should refresh your connection to the stream and then it should be faster, if that makes sense. Because popping someone on there and then having it be 20 seconds before they can type in the first command and then another 20 seconds before they see what the next command is. And then another 20 seconds to see what the next... By that point, the recipe's fallen off. Well. Um, and it's not... 
Ooh. Oh, cat with the resub. Thank you so much. So generous of you. Thank you for your support. Hey, chaotic. How you doing? There is usually a double exclamation or having check spelling on words like wiener yum. Yeah, look, it's not a normal word for people to be typing. Um, but yeah, there's yeah spelling errors are a thing. Obviously, I'm I'm I can't check chat and and like point at people typing things wrong and stuff. I I like. I unfortunately am not able to help you with that bit because um, I've got too many other things to be watching. Uh, so definitely have a look at your messages, not necessarily before you send them. I know you want to get them out real quick and I totally get that, but maybe once it has been sent, just double check what you've said um, to make sure it matches. And if it does match and it still doesn't update for like 10 seconds or more, then you might be having a, a wonky connection. Um, it could be buffer size, it could be latency, uh, both of which will affect your connection to Twitch. And usually it's fine. It means that I just reply to a question 10 seconds later or something, but because this is such a time-based game, um, it can be a really good idea to refresh after the end of each day or right before a new day starts. Um, that way you know that your connection is going to be as quick as it possibly can be. Um, but all just all just little tips, because yeah, um, having, having things fall off like that, especially like as soon as it pops up and I drag someone onto it straight away, and then having that person still there prepping whatever it is they're prepping when it falls off that that something's wrong there something's really wrong um that's um like yeah if if, if it was going too quickly the game wouldn't be functional um and it is because we got to like what day did we get to it was like 20 -something. another challenge nothing we can't handle oh good customers are a bit more impatient to get their delicious food good luck squad so all the tips i was talking about are 100% really super duper important now because it's going to take it's going to be even faster for them to run off the top of the thing. Uh, so we'll give it a f we'll, we'll keep going obviously. Um, but yeah, definitely some good tips is to check what you've sent after you've sent it. Like every time, double check you've sent the right thing. Um, and at the end of every day, refreshing the page just to make sure that the buffer is as small as it can be and your latency is as, as small as it can be. Um, but yeah, and yeah, looking for, for double exclamations and things like that, like Nidhi said, is a really, really, really good idea. And of course, like, if I place you and you're like, shit, what did you say? Fuck, I think it might have been... Shit, was it... I think it was that? No, don't, don't do that. Just ask. <laughs> Exclamation which one puts up a big flashing thing over your head in-game and I can see it and I can tell you. I can say it again straight away. Of course, if you have a massive latency, me saying it again, you're not going to hear it for another 10, 20 seconds, which is a problem. Um, so that's why, you know, latency is a really big deal. But um, yeah, like, ask. You're always welcome to ask. Um, <laughs> I mean, hey, got a taste test. Make sure it's fine, right? Or something. I don't know. Crazy people eating raw peppers. What the hell? Ah, uh, some of these words are concerning ribbed eyes. Yeah, look, it's a thing. I'm gonna have it now. I'm looking as soon as Of course, yeah, I can imagine. I can imagine. Eat pepper yum, excuse me. I know, look, they're lying, but that's fine. Ready to service in Beer's Kitchen. Hello, Nano. Welcome on in. Welcome back. Got this. Only cheese broth, half the words we type. But cheese, okay. Because I'm like, is it chicken? Is it cheese? Is it like. What is this? Um, good. I'm glad it's cheese broth. But then I'm like, cheese broth? Who the fuck makes cheese broth? I use chicken broth like every second day or something, but like cheese, I don't think I've ever used a cheese broth. It's so, do you know, it's odd. So odd. Look, pepper haters. Yes, correct. Hey, more for you lot. More for you crazy people. What should we Speaking. cook today? Ooh, what am I going to make? Um, pasta. I liked the pasta, that was fun. Very, very bad reaction to pepper. Me too, I go. I'm kidding. Usually I stomach it. If it like if it's in my mouth already, I'll just kind of swallow it. But um, I'm not allergic to it or anything though, so I can. I know others have different issues and that is totally reasonable. Vote for what is on the menu. This equals awesomes. Love bell peppers. More for you guys. More for you guys. All right, we've got pasta, hot dogs, and chicken sandwich respect their reaction <laughs> all right uh here we go begin hiring Let's exclamation go, hire me
exclamation Hayami to join us in the kitchen. I'm going to die if I've only got three chefs. <laughs> 20 seconds. You need to go? Go grab some gloves or pop a heater on or something. And head out. Customize. <laughs> it is interesting, Kay, that it actually shows the combination you've chosen rather than putting random. Although I guess it helps other people pick that specific one if they decide they like it like that. Which is kind of cool. Okay. Bugger. I just missed hitting the snooze button on the ads. I don't think... Oh no, everyone everyone who's playing... Oh no, Nano's not subbed. Okay. Um, so there's an ad playing. So I'm gonna let that play, just so that obviously we don't die. Um, would recommend you, now is the time that you check your video stats on the player. And if it's any more than like eight seconds, hit the refresh button. Just to refresh that connection, make sure you're good and quick, and uh, and then we can get started once the ad is finished. We only got a minute left on it. Hi, the sun. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, that is so kind of you. So generous of you. Thank you so much for the gifted sub to Nano. It's too late and see one. Fantastic. That's awesome. Yeah, mine's not. Um, as an Australian, I mean, even though we're going to like Sydney servers or whatever, um, my buffer and stuff is still like six to seven seconds. Um, so that's why like I know that eight is kind of the the ceiling of a good connection, especially for something like this where eight seconds is a long time when the whole thing is only is it like 180 seconds for the entire round. Um, maybe three second day, amazing. Two to two point five, brilliant, wonderful some sauce. Alright, well, that looks good then. And I don't think Nano's in an ad anymore, so <laughs> that's good. Um, so, we do have a couple seconds left on the ad. I might just let it go, just so that if we've got people who are lurking, who are curious, maybe they get to see how it's played. Hello, cars. Welcome on in. Alright, let's go. Mm -hmm. Chicken for meaty. Uh, spicy chicken for this year. Mano can do a hot dog, and Kay can do a vegan dog, and the bot can do pasta. The other bot can do cheese. <clears throat> uh, hello, Nagami. Hello, Violet. Welcome on in. Um, Nano, I said the hot dogs, so the top one. Yep. Cool. Um,. That bot. Serve. Okay, I'll get you to do pickle. Herbs been chosen. I can. There we go. Drop in for herbs. Meaty can do onion. This year can do tomato. I'll to hold the bot until everyone's chosen so I can do cheese. Go cheese for that bot. Uh, Nano can do tomato. Can serve meaty. Can serve. Desia can do onion. K can do pickle. Nice. Nope, now I can do dishes. What can Excellent. Serve? K can do cheese. Meaty can do tomato. C 
Alicia can serve. Way to go! Stir as well. Of they are amazing. Uh, K, vegan hot dog, please. Desia, cheese. Okay. BT can serve. Mm -hmm. Nano can do spicy chicken. Trash. What can do herbs? Sia can do lettuce. Go squat. Meaty can serve. K can do pickle. What can do Stay chicken. complete. Let's wrap it up, squad. Uh, Desia's lettuce. Herb and Nano. Nano can do pickle. Go squad! Ah! Um, okay. Well, one is better than what we're doing before. That's good. Good. Doing the seven. Good. Nice. Done. Another day completed. Oh, a new okay. food upgrade. Uh, oh, food okay. Now, squad. Are we upgrading pasta or hot dogs? Your call. Throw it in chat with exclamation pasta or exclamation hot dogs. So it doesn't, because I know I am speaking a little softer than usual because of my stupid throat. Um, hopefully that'll help with that. Wow, all the love for the hot dog. All the love for the hot dogs. Still got 30 seconds to vote though. Anyone can vote, you don't have to have played in the last round. Anyone in chat at all can vote. Anyone pasta or hot dog to upgrade. <laughs> Looks like hot dog is being upgraded. But hey, yeah, we know. Perfect. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. If you encounter any lag, try refreshing the screen. Definitely a good. What should we cook hint. today, squad? Uh, I want to see how the upgrade works. So, vote on what else you would like to see on the menu. Top two votes get chosen for the menu: pasta, steak, sandwich, lasagna, burger, pizza, salad, chicken, soup. Vote now. Do the votes. Pasta, hot dogs, and soup. Here we go. Time to squad up. Exclamation, hire me in chat if you would like to join the squad. If you want to play with us, it's by typing in chat, exclamation, hire me. We'll pop you into this round. It doesn't commit you to like the rest of everything. It's just for this round. Fifteen-ish by the time you hear me. Seconds left to join the kitchen for this round. I wonder how many days we have left in like the storyline. 
Well, not the storyline, but like all the unlockings and stuff. Alrighty. Let's suit up. Butts. And head out. Good. Uh, pop in your customizations. If you would like to, you can choose a letter and a number, or you can type exclamation random if you so desire. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh dear. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's all. Everything is fine. <laughs> I know the feeling. I know this feeling intimately. Oh dear. I am. Um, okay, so um, I was doing some work yesterday. I was stitching. I was cross stitching, and I was starting a new a new pattern. And um, and uh, I had. So every every if you've ever cross stitched, you'll know this. But for anyone who hasn't cross stitched, when you get a pattern, there'll be like usually you start stitching from the middle so that you can place it where you want it on on your piece of fabric. So every pattern will have like a marker at the center point, horizontal and vertical, and then like a dotted line or whatever that'll cross over so you know where the middle point is on your pattern. So you find the middle point on the pattern, you grab your fabric, you fold it in half one way, you fold it in half the other way, and then where those folds meet, that's the center of your fabric. And so that's where you start, you stitch close to that and then kind of work your way out so that you can make sure it's where you want it, right? Um, so it turns out the pattern reader I have does a different color of dotted lines where the pages, because like this pattern I'm working on is multiple pages, it's like nine or ten pages or something. Um, and so every time there's a page edge, it has an orange dotted line. Then it has a red dotted line for the center. So I started stitching and I did like a hundred and something stitches. And then I realized that the center of my fabric was the, co the bottom corner of the first page on my pattern. So I did what we call frogging. I had to frog all my stitches. And the reason you call it frogging is because you just rip it. <laughs> you just rip it. Because there's no, like some people they'll, you know, go through carefully and try to save the thread and all that kind of stuff. Because the bits I'm stitching were just so small, I just I just frogged it because it's I just I felt I was so salty. So salty. Like an hour and something of work because I was high on painkillers and all down the drain. Yeah. So I know that the, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I get it. <laughs> uh, yeah, very salty, but it's okay. It's fine. I'm actually, I'm a lot further along now than I thought I would be at this point, which I'm really happy about. Uh, let's, let's actually cook rather than talk about fear stitching. All right, Nano, you are first up and you are doing pasta. Desia, can I have some, actually a hot dog? And Kay, could I get a vegan hot dog? Um, maybe I'm gonna get you to do tomato. And then once you've chosen your tomato, I'll pop these guys on to do the herb and cheese. Perfect. Cause they, they will automatically pick and I don't, if I put them down and you're not quite fast enough, they'll pick out from under you. Yeah, it's bad. Uh, bot can do cheese. Uh, Nano can do tomato, please. Mm, tasty. Uh, Meaty, if you could do the green broth, I think it's P. <laughs> K for broccoli. K is not for broccoli. K is for other things, but I'm gonna get you to do some broccoli. <laughs> and the bot can do the cheese. Oh god, I'm hilarious. Don't you all agree? Uh, regular broth for you, please. This here, uh, Nano's onion. And I get the bot to do cheese once. No, nope, I'm gonna get the bot to do trash. K can do cheese. Wait, can I do broccoli? Mm, hang on. Ah, oh, okay, the bot can do broccoli. Yep, cool, perfect. <clears throat> Why is the green potato broth? That confuses the hell out of me. Uh, nano on, no, nano on dishes. K on capsicum, meaty on onion. What can we do past? Oh, we dropped him in, we dropped him out. Go squat. 
I must have been the broth not going fast enough. Ah, uh, tomato from Desir, please. What can do a hot dog? Ah, uh, Kay can do a capsicum. Oops. For God's sake. Uh, pasta from Meaty, please. Ouch. Okay. <laughs> uh, Desir can order up, and Kay can do cheese broth. And Nano can do trash. Meaty onion, please. Yum. Day complete. Let's wrap it up, squad. Just see our order up. And then the bot will once we've got the onion ready. We'll be perfect. Perfect as in one order away from a uh, Failed day, but that's fine. That's fine. We win. Winning is fine. That's why I don't like bots. Sometimes they don't need to be clicked and sometimes they do. Squad and it just... Oh, if I miss it, everything just goes to hell. So the more chefs we have, the better. Another so I don't have to... Completed. I don't have to watch the bots and then also watch for you guys and watch for new orders and look, it's... uh Yeah. Fun times. A new food upgrade. Money is what counts. Look, sometimes. All right, we have sandwich or pasta upgrade. So sandwich would be going from three to four. Pasta would be going from two to three. Vote now. Vote now. Vote now. Computer broth is not only confusing, but the typing is long and annoying. Yeah. Why is it green? It makes more sense for it to be pea broth, right? Or veggie broth at the very least. <laughs> totally fine to do. Potato and pea, maybe? Yeah. Mm. Potato and broccoli? Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm. Honestly, it could just be vegetable. And green is a really powerful color. <laughs> And it's based, you know, it's made with potato, but the green just kind of overflows. Mm. Available ingredients. Mm. Well, the the ingredients on that side don't go into the broths. They're made, all that stuff's made separately. It's weird the way that it operates, but it's fine. Okay, so there are 55 days, we're on 28. So this, look, we're not doing too badly. We're not doing too badly. What should we cook today, squad? I want to see what the new pasta's like. Maybe we'll get different types of, maybe we'll get like ravioli or something. But now you gotta vote. So like steak, sandwich, lasagna, hot dog, burger, pizza, salad, chicken soup. Choose what you would like to be on the menu for today. Kay has voted for steak, as has Nano. Is he gonna just pick another one by random, maybe? It does, and pick chicken, brilliant. Here we go. Chef squad. Exclamation, hire me if you would like to join the kitchen. Even if you are lurking, you don't actually have to say anything that's personal. You can just type in exactly what the commands are and that is it. And we will not try to engage you on a personal level if you do not desire to be. You can still join the kitchen with us. We don't have to. Like some people want to lurk because they don't want to actually like interact with people because you know of whatever reason, and that's totally fine. I, I will not even ask you how you are if you do not wish to be asked. You can still come cook with us if you would like. So I can, yeah, absolutely. If I break up this round, totally fair. Sounds great. Like, right, okay. I think I think it just because it was separate lines and you were taking a while to type out each one, the, the sarcasm part didn't come in fast enough. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> 
Alrighty. Here we go. Ready. I shouldn't have been dancing like that now. I'm nauseous. Okay. Nano. T-bone, please. K. Chicken burger. Meaty. Pasta. We have spinach pasta. Okay, good. Finished pasture as well. Might as well. Okay, I'll get you to serve. Oop, get you to serve. Do mushroom. Uh, meaty can do pickle. Nano can do herb. Excellent. Go squad, go. Uh, Nano can serve. Meaty can serve. What for this one and what for this one? Ah, uh, T-bone, please, Kay. Sorry. T-bone. It's a T-bone. My apologies. I'm pretty sure I said that, but if I didn't, I am feeling a little bit wonky. <laughs> so that might have been absolutely my bad. Oh, uh, dear. Good job. Uh, Nano, if I could get you to do a capsicum pepper, and Meaty, could you grab mushroom for me, please? Um, K, I'll get you to do pickle. K will do pickle, and the bottle do the herbs. Yes. Just oh, no, there's already. Oh no, because that's up there. Nano can do onion, please. I promise these are digital onions, they won't make you cry. I promise. Meaty, could you serve, please? Uh, bot can do pepper. K can do herbs. Uh, bot can do trash. <clears throat> okay. Bot can do spinach pasta. Bot can do chicken. Uh, Nano can do pepper. Uh, like the capsicum pepper. Yep. Squad. Um, K can do tomato and meaty can do cheese. Perfect. And Nano will be on service in just a second. That cheese is done. Ah, oh, bugger! Just oh. oh, if I had one extra second to be able to drag up, we would we wouldn't have been able to catch that last order. Oh well, close. We only missed one order. That's really good, and it was just that last one. That's wonderful. Well done. Well done. Ah, <sighs> okay. Hmm. What do you think, squad? Do we want baked potato or nachos? You don't have to be playing to choose. Anybody can vote. Anyone can vote. Exclamation potato or exclamation nachos. No, no, totally fine, Meaty. Totally fine. It's all good. It's all good. Mushroom. <laughs> Always potato. Yeah, I, I personally would... If, if these two options were presented to me for food right now, I would definitely go baked potato. That's not like... And that's not just because my throat is like sore as fuck. Um, potato is annoying to type. Correct. Take a minute to sleep in any case. Yeah, you don't need to ask permission to work, Nano. Yes. Good lord. 
It's like asking your television if you can go and take a bathroom break. Like, don't be silly. Just... <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Um, there was a talk of a bio break earlier. Um, what should we cook today? First, we're gonna I'm gonna choose this. So you vote for your stuff, and then after this, I'm not gonna open the hiring up for a minute or two. So make your choices for menu items, and then skedaddle and do what you need to do. Do your bathroom breaks and stuff like that. Um, and then we'll take a brief moment. <laughs> All right, baked potato, hot dogs, and chicken sandwich. All right, um, we've got an ad that's about to start. I might just do it now. Go take your breaks. Uh, and then once the ad's done, we'll, uh, we'll come back and begin our next day. Go AFK2. Oh, hi. Get back as the ad finishes. I'm getting good at that. Oh, it's just me. All right. I only had like a ready check in chat that I could do. <laughs> uh, all right. Hello. Hello, okay. We're going to begin hiring. You do have a minute to, to be hired. So. Let's go, squad. Do the thing. Exclamation. Hire me in chat to join the squad. Oh, it's a jazz. This would be hilarious. I promise I will try to put you on stuff that you actually know how to cook. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Honestly, at this point, I reckon we could stick anything in front of Jas and he'd just like figure out how to cook it. <laughs> Although, the, at this point, anything we stick in front of Jas is probably just gonna toss in onion, uh, toss in onion, toss in oil, salt and pepper. Thwack or two of cinnamon and into a pan. <laughs> Done. <laughs> and you know what? There are not very many things that cannot be cooked like that. You don't have to worry about just doing an injury this way. Look, if anyone could injure themselves in a virtual kitchen, it would be Jazz. I would, oh my God. Suit up and head out. God, if I had the money, I would absolutely do a VR setup and do cooking streams, but like in VR and like do the, and it would be hilarious. And I bet you, I bet you that Jas would find a way to injure himself in game. Ah, uh, I toss spices in there too. You do, you absolutely do. But when in doubt, like if you don't know what other spices to use, like you know that cinnamon always works, which is great because we have literally like close to half a kilo of cinnamon at the moment. <laughs> Jeez, you're right. I am right. I am right. All right. Are we ready? Fiamali, Fianati. You are, you're all Fianati. Get ready. It's a lot of cinnamon. It is. I bought a jar 
doing online shopping, like click and collect. I bought a jar and they were out of stock of the jars. So they gave me like a whole ass paper bag full of the Hoyt sachets. <laughs> so that's up in the spice cupboard. And every time the jar runs out, we just cut open a new one and dump it back in the old jar. It's perfection. I love it. So, um, yes. <laughs> Idiots. Uh, all right. But I, I do eat a lot, like cinnamon. I wasn't kidding when I said cinnamon's one of my favorite flavors. Uh, meaty chicken, please. K, hot dog. Jas, spud. Please and thank you. But yeah, like um, cinnamon just goes so well with so many different things. It's why it's one of my favorite things to use. It's just so good. Load poto. Good. Uh, Kay, could I get a vegan hot dog from you, please? Got to serve. Uh, Jas, could you do spicy chicken for me? And actually, me, I'll get you to do a spud. Who's <clears throat> what? Vegan dog. Okay, I'll get you to serve. These and shanks. Oh crap. I hate having the bots spread across too many stations. I can't see what they're doing. Uh, Jess, tomato please. Mmm, tasty. Meaty on cheese. <clears throat> Pickle. Uh, Kay, I'll get you on herbs so that the bot can grab lettuce without having to wait because the bots are bastards. As we know. Squad, no. Oh no. First one. It's okay. Uh, meaty. Capsicum, please. Uh, Jas, could you do a chicken burger and K on a spicy chicken? <laughs> Meaty on service, please. K on service. Way to go. Jass on service. Day complete. Let's wrap it up, squad. Okay. <laughs> that went pretty well. Okay. Just gets the last dish of the day. Sweet indeed. We did. I think we did. We had one failed one, but overall, I think that went pretty fluidly. I think the key is putting all my bots on the ingredients bench in the middle, like doing those ones, because then I can see them all right there and I can click them if I need to. I started getting panicky when they were all over the place. <clears throat> Jazz. Uh, I've also decided I dislike all the wiener commands. That's a solid plan. I cannot promise you I will not put you on wieners, but I can I try and forget. Oh, all right. Squad. Do you want to upgrade pizza from three to four or baked potato from two to three? Your call. Vote in chat. <laughs> Fuck it. Fucking cooked it is not a valid command, Jess. <laughs> Did you enjoy yourself though? Was it fun? How many times did you typo before you had to like delete and redo? Heck the head chef. That is how you get demoted, my friend. 
Ah, uh, had a bubble tea in your honor. Oh, dupe. I'm so pleased to hear that. And hello. Welcome on in. What what was it like? Tell me, tell me. Let me live vicariously through because I still can't use straws. Uh, I've been using a straw as like a mixing implement, but I can't actually drink using it. So, um, like, what flavor was it? Did you have any toppings? Like sugar level, ice level? Tell me all about your order and whether or not, of course, you enjoyed it. Jazz is fired. Well, no, we kind of need Jazz. Honestly, we don't have very many chefs, so. <laughs> uh, mutiny it is. See, I've read that as mutiny-itis. As in, like, an infection of your mutiny. Um, like, mutiny-itis. Yep, good. My brain is totally functional. I promise. Black tea, green apple. Ooh, yum. Green apple, black tea is good. Good choice. Rainbow jelly. On it. Demoted to dish pig. I read it that way too. Good. I'm glad it's not just me, meat. I'm so pleased. <laughs> Fear is crazy. Well, yeah, but you knew that. Start my own kitchen. You'd have to stream to do that. All right. What should we cook today? We're going to cook the new baked potato because I want to see what it is. But vote, guys, for the rest of everything else. I jacked the bandwidth. Or the work cover claims. <laughs> oh, no, nah, none of the work. They wouldn't cover him. They wouldn't cover him. Uh, choose the rest of your menu, guys. Choose what you would like to cook for today. Lasagna. Oh, why did that not register? Oh, because it's lasagna. Good. <laughs> I'm like, why did that? I didn't even see it. And then I was like, oh. <laughs> the Sanger. So we were technically voting for sandwich, right? I guess. I mean, look. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I don't mean to make fun. It's. I, I promise you, this is coming from a place of I can see myself doing that. This is why it's funny. Um, in fact, I would be if I didn't. If I was using. I mean, even when I use my mouth instead of my hands to type, uh, it. It. I still end up with typos. <sighs> Uh, all right, you did enter a little too soon, but that's okay. okay. You can do it now. Bad. Exclamation! Hire me to join the Fianati Kitchen or the Fiamali Kitchen, technically. Hello, Braddy. Welcome on in. Lasagna is a type of sandwich, technically. You could you could say that it's also a cake. New chef indeed. Um, Braddy, feel free to, like, if you if you don't know how to play, let us know. Otherwise, I'll just assume you have. Like, you, you don't need to say anything extra if you don't want to. Um, but otherwise, there is a tutorial video I can hit play after this so you can see how we play um, if you if you need a refresher. Just let us know. You played? Perfect. Not a worry. Just wanted to make sure everyone was not feeling too stressed. <laughs> but welcome on in. Hope you're having a fantastic day. And it is also just a party in my mouth. Well, yeah, there's that too. So at the moment I'll stick to spectating. Totally fair. Hello, Trud. Welcome on in. Up and head out. I wonder if you could like refresh it a bunch of times and get a good connection eventually. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe. Stress and stress. You feeling better today? Yeah, I'm getting there. I, I still hurt and my throat is still a bit fucked up. Um, I still have like ulcers all over the back of my throat and stuff, which is fantastic. Uh, but they don't hurt as much as they did on Friday. Like, drinking water no longer feels like swallowing razor blades. So that is an improvement. Um, however, milk has been feeling, like, a lot better than than water. Um, but look, I'm getting there. I've got to check up with my surgeon. Because um, tomorrow is, like, one week since surgery. Uh, so I've got to check up with him tomorrow. And he'll obviously, because the, the ulcers are a side effect from the surgery, so he'll take a look and, and just make sure that he's happy with... Um, how everything looks if he wants to prescribe me anything extra then he can do so that kind of thing but fingers crossed it's just um on its way to healed uh, i'm just sure if i expect damn pants to be a command for him i would not doubt it at all would not doubt that at all all right it is good news yeah i'm i'm quite happy with that can't wait for my wisdom extraction stitches to go away yeah these ones these stitches feel really hard and spiky um i know that they're the dis i know that they're the um dissolvable ones but they're they don't feel as soft and squishy as the last ones did. I don't know. It just, maybe it's because I'm actually conscious faster. Because last time it took me a full week before I even 
remembered what I was doing, let alone could feel stuff in my mouth properly. Um, Cause much more painkillers, but this time around I'm, it's a bit faster. So yeah, we'll see. All right, here we go. I'm sticking up, I can feel it. Ooh, have you got a checkup? K on T-bone please. Uh, bratty on hot dog. Meaty on vegan hot dog. Jass on spud. Um, if you've got a checkup with them soonish, uh, you might get them be able to get them to trim the stitches a little. Maybe, I don't know, it just I guess it'll depend on the person you've got, but you might be able to trim it for you. Uh, K on service. Please. Uh, and Braddy, I'll pop you on rib. Nice. K on service again. Jas, what are you doing? <laughs> there we go. Meaty on service. Uh, Jas on hot dog, please. Not vegan, regular hot dog. K on trash, sorry. Squad. Uh, Braddy, if I could get you to do a spud. Uh, meaty on a T bone. Jass on trash. That's dishes, sorry. Jass on dishes. Uh, Braddy on service and K on service as well, please. <clears throat> go, squad, go. Uh, K on service again. Braddy on service. What's the next one coming in? What's Meaty gonna be making? A spud. Meaty on spud, please. Okay. Potato. Uh, K on a T bone and Jass on a hot dog, please. Um, Braddy, I might get you on a rib. Ah, bugger. Oh well, that's right. Uh, meaty on service. Looks like we're good. Good job. Let us go. Oh my god. I am rib. I love this. There are so many because I don't get to see many of them. It's hilarious. Sizzlebone. Rolling dog. Nice work, Tim, indeed. Mm, tasty. Steak boned. Perfect day. Wonderful work, squad. Flip eyes are god. Yep. Because you're flipping the ribeye, you know? It's a yep. Well done. It was a perfect Another day. Challenge. Nothing we can handle. Oh, ingredient ingredient quality upgraded. So now harder to make. So I guess it just takes an extra step. What should we do? Oh, right. Mash trash is nasty. Ooh. We don't have any up. What do I want to. I love how we've perfectly upgraded, like everything's three. Let's go sandwich. All right, choose what other two things you would like on the menu for today. You don't have to be playing to be able to help pick the menu. Uh, just exclamation and then your choice of what you'd like to add to the menu. Top two will get chosen. Do not need to play the actual cooking part with us to be able to vote. Anyone in chat can vote. Better than wiener trash, look. Roast pork is not an option, Jazz. In fact, that last thing there is nachos that we haven't unlocked yet. No roast pork for you. 
Here we go. Time to squat up. Exclamation, hire me. In chat, unlocked almost everything. Unlocked, yes, but then we gotta upgrade everything. I know that everything goes to at least level four. Uh, and then things are going to probably be more complicated and stuff. We've got 55 days to get through and we're on, we just cleared, I think, 31. So we're, we're getting there. We're definitely getting there. Having fun. I'm really enjoying myself. The more chefs we have, the easier the game is, obviously. Because, um, I mean, the, the more space you guys get between your, um, your, your orders and stuff. And also the fewer bots I have to watch. Uh, um, but yeah, it's... Uh, Bots are a pain in the ass sometimes. I mean, they're good to have, obviously, when you only have a couple chefs. But, um, yeah, it, it definitely makes it, the more chefs you have, it makes it a lot easier to play. But, and more fun, too, because you get more people involved. But that's okay. I get that not everyone has a latency and stuff, so. Let's suit up and head out. Train. Brilliant. Choose your customizations. Or random, if you so desire, of course. though. Alrighty. Here we go. Okay, bratty on a chicken, please. K on spicy chicken. Meaty on a single patty. Jass on white bread, please and thank you. How do you prep white bread for a sandwich? <clears throat> Oh, you actually bake it. Okay, sure. Uh, bratty, I'll get you to do uh, wheat bread. A on service. And Jass on a double patty. Meaty on service, Ooh, please. Uh, K on spicy chicken. Uh, bratty on white bread. Meaty on a double patty, please. Uh, oh, where are we on? K on double patty, please. Braddy on, oh, Braddy on service. Bass on service. Just a second behind. Braddy on service, please. We're just behind with the, um, the patty. We missed out on that one order, I think. Unfortunately. Uh, K on a chicken patty, please. Excellent. Meaty on service. Braddy on service. Jass on a spicy chicken patty. service. K on white bread. Go squat. Meaty on wheat bread. Okay. Stay complete. Let's wrap it up. Oh, squad. that's everything. All right, cool. Uh, Jass on lettuce. Please and thank you. That'll be us. Ah, 
Perhaps you're on lettuce. <laughs> Braddy on service. picked a pickle. This this is a pickle, but it was ticked off. This one wasn't. And that's lettuce. Yum. <laughs> oh dear. Lucky I noticed I'm like, cut pickle? He's making what? Oh. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. You made a pickle. You did. You sliced a pickle. Ready to put on nothing. <laughs> what a pickle. <laughs> Oh dear. A new food upgrade. Oh, all right. What are we oh, upgrading? Yeah, are we upgrading pasta or steak? I like pickles, but they can't be like soggy or whatever. They have to be like actual crunchy, crispy pickles, not like sliced pickles you get on burgers and stuff like that. They're usually eh. Uh, it looks like we're upgrading the steak. <laughs> pasta or steak, y'all. Still got more than thirty seconds to vote. Make sure you do exclamation and then your choice in chat. Okay, steak is it, by the looks of it. Okay, so steak is our first upgrade to level four. So I wanna see what we have to do with it. What should we cook today, squad? Uh, we're gonna make steak, where is it? Oh, it's max, okay, so level four is max. Choose the rest of your menu. Fellow chefs. The, the choices are on each of the placards. It's the exclamation word. You can pop that into chat and choose what you would like to have on the rest of the menu, apart from the steak. It'll choose the top two for votes. Potato. All right. And pasta. Cool. Steak, pasta, and potato. Oh, you chicken for the chicken ones. There you go. Interesting. Ah, uh, begin hiring. Uh, the number of uh, check discs I've been running lately on my PC. There's just a couple things that have been going really funky. So I've been running a check disc almost every couple days. I'm, I'm getting there <laughs> with the with the typing. Exclamation hire me in chat to join the squad. To join the chef squad. Exclamation hire me. 15 seconds to go. Looks like it's just me and Kay in the kitchen. Should I cook with us? Look, I mean, I just have to figure out how to use the bots more effectively, won't I? Alright. Oh, okay. Here we go. Uh, choose your... Oh my god, and three of the bots look the same. Good. Well, similar. Not quite exactly the same, but very close. Um, just, you just got an indeed, just. That's right, four bots. I'll be fine. Fine. I'll be totally fine. Sure. <laughs> Sorry, we'll see how we go. Okay, let's give this a try. Alright, K on Spud, Desia on Pasta. And let's get the bots running on... Oh good, why are they all making onion? Okay. Oh, so now there's... what is... is that New York Strip? Is that what they call that? NYS? Okay, on service. But on service as well. 
we're gonna pop to see what's coming up next. Oh good. Uh, can I get you to do a spud for us? So... Go squad, go! It's okay. Uh, pasta please. Good job. Spinach pasta. Them. Uh, okay, can serve. Perfect. I don't like this. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, um, this one. Let's see, I can serve. Good. Way to go. <laughs> K on dishes. Woo. What am I doing? What is happening? Ruining. Even though. Uh. Tasty. Spud. Go. Uh, to see her on pasta, please. Perfect. Uh, 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 spinach pasta for Kay. Please. Oh, there's a clip to prep. Serve. See, I can spud. Let's wrap it up, squad. Did I click that? No, good. Um. Tasty. Wonderful work, squad. But what? But at what cost? Good lord! The just the, all the blip 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 blip. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, mm. Half the time, I thought I'd put one of you guys down and just hadn't told you, expecting you to do what you're supposed to do because you're a bot. Mm, yep. <laughs> Look, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I see why I, I see so Odysseus latency died. We'll leave it at that. Um you did amazing. I Mush brain. A new food upgrade. Oh! Food okay. Now, Are we upgrading salad or burger? Your choice. Vote in chat now. Salad or burger. Bun between two buns or salad, 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 salad. Cast your votes. And yeah, no need to apologize to say it. shit happens. It's all good. That was, um. That was an experience. Should I open that much? Yeah, ditto. I have <laughs> not nutritious, but certainly delicious. My jaw is like grinding 
I think I said at the start of the stream it sounds like a, a machinery from the 1960s. Like it's just grinding. But I've got an appointment with my surgeon on Monday and I'm sure he'll poke and prod me and then decide what he, he thinks. But yeah. What's All right. Today? Mm, what do we just upgrade? The burger. I want to see what the upgrade looks like. You guys vote. Exclamation food. To vote for what you would like to add to the menu. You do not need to be playing to vote what is on the menu. Your call. Exclamation type of food. Yep, smart ass. Exclamation type of food. Uh, to vote for that type of food, put it on the menu. Otherwise, it'll randomize the other one, I think. So we've got potato. Uh, hello, El Rey. Try to say goodnight. I hope you've all been well. I'm getting there. I'm definitely recovering. Definitely recovering. Uh, fantastic. Enjoy yourself, Nagami. We'll see you next time or later. Either way, either or. Enjoy yourself. Uh, exclamation hire me. Exclamation hire me. If you would like to join the family in the kitchen, in the chef squad. I like marshmallows. They're soft and tasty. Hello, coin. How are you doing? Exclamation hire me if you'd like to join us in game. There is a video I can show you after this to teach you how to play. Well then, Kay. <laughs> if I if I drag and drop you and I don't say something because I fear I forget that you're not a butt, just immediately which one me and I'll I'll say something. We had a bunch of fear control bots. Yeah, pretty much. It's gonna be great. Oh good, thank you. I appreciate that. I right, look. This is gonna be a time. We're gonna have some times. Do you know you're not a bot as well? Uh, yeah, true. Okay, doesn't. Fantastic. All right. Ready. <clears throat> hey, Kay. Spud. <laughs> Says. Oh, you can get a triple patty now. Fantastic. Bot. Bot. K on service. Or I'll try to put you up top <laughs> so that there's no question about what you're doing. <laughs> that should help a little bit, right? Jeez. Go squat! Service! Is up next. What is it? What is it gonna ask for? Do we think? Uh, I might put you on Spud. I feel like we're gonna need a Spud sooner rather than later. Mmm, tasty. Ah, oh, sink full. Oh. Wrong. Okay. Me out. Oh, pasta for K. Yes. Oh, 
Oh, I'm sorry, Kay. Good job. Nice. Day complete. Let's wrap it up, squad. Okay. <laughs> this is far less entertaining when it's just made a bunch of bots and K. <laughs> not that K is not entertaining. It's just I don't get to talk to people as much. Perfect day. Wonderful it's work. Definitely squad. more fun when there's a whole squad of people. We do got this. We do. We are smashing it, K. We are smashing it. But it is definitely more fun when we have more people in involved. We got this perfect no day. Upgrade. Oh, okay. Oh, do we no, want to squad. upgrade upgrade the salad or the chimkin sandwich? And more of a fun coass with more people. I agree. I agree. But hey, look, if people are busy and stuff, that's okay. Like, um, they, don't, they don't have any responsibility to be here, so it's totally all right. Tried. I'm sorry. You did try. You did really well, Jess. You did really well. But you're busy. It's okay. I know. Hope you unlock the stuffs. Awesome. Yes, pet chicken. Yum, yum, yum. What are we... Where am I... Do I have achievements? This game might not actually have achievements. Yeah. No achievements. That's sad. That that makes me sad. But the chicken one. All right. What Next day. Uh, let's see what the chicken looks like. Vote for what else you would like on the menu. Exclamation type of food. To vote for that type of food to be included on the menu. Uh, and the top two by votes. <laughs> the chicken sandwich thing is the breast there is. It's a slogan for chicken. Yep, the rest there is. Spider's potato, okay. Spider's potato. Just went to the soup. That's okay. We have potato, chicken, and uh, is that pizza? I think it's pizza. Okay. Can Exclamation, hire me if you would like to join the kitchen. Exclamation, hire me. Uh, I drag and drop you as a chef to a station and I tell you what I would like you to make and then you type into chat things that pop up above your head or next to your head uh, to, it tells you what to make, uh, what to type, how to make it. Uh, it's good fun. It's enjoyable. There is also a tutorial video if you would like to watch that before we start the day. I'm more than happy to play that again for anyone who would like a, a bit of a rundown. The worst apprenticeship. That's okay, pet. Would you like to see the? Would you like to see the video before we hit go on the day? Totally up to you. Kind of gives you a brief rundown on how to play. Might make it a little bit easy for easier for you. Indeed, you wing it already. Be great, I'm sure. Perfect. I'll try to. I'll try to give you as much information as I can. I'll try to help you out uh, while I'm wrangling my four bots. <laughs> Oh dear. Feel free to customize your looks if you so desire. Hmm. <laughs> Just like a real kitchen, real ra yell random things and, and pray, basically. Okay. Kay's up first. All right, Kay, I'm gonna get you to do a pizza crust. Pet, I'll get you to do a spud. So that's exclamation SPD here to choose that one there. I'll pop the bots on the ingredients down the middle.
Uh, K on service, please. Um, Petrius, I'll get you up top during service. And K, same for you, service as well. On Spud, please. And Pet, I'll get you to do chicken. So it's the CHK one here, the top one. A thin crust pizza, please. Okay. Come on, next time. Uh, service, perfect. Pet, I'll get you to do service up top. service for K as well. Go squad. Uh, service for pet. Uh, pizza crust for K. Regular pizza crust. Hang on, yeah. Basically, if only that worked in real okay. restaurants. Wonderful work, squad. Well done. Good job, yay! Oh, Ooh, we'll are we un squad. are we upgrading hot dogs or pasta? Your call. Exclamation hot dog, exclamation pasta. Upgrade your desire from level three to level four. Ping ping. Can I vote? Oh my god, I can vote! That's cheeky. I shouldn't have done that, I'm so sorry. I wanted to see, and it turns out I can. <laughs> the other variety of hot dog. Oh, yeah, true. It's got like hot dog and vegan hot dog. Maybe like a bratwurst or something? Fair that you can. Yeah, I know, but like this is supposed to be for you guys. It should still go with hot dog because that was the first one to get to two. Corn dog. Ooh, it could. We're about to find out. Because I'm guessing the other one's going to be like squid ink pasta or tomato pasta or something. Do you know what I mean? Like that's, yeah. Okay. What should we cook today, squad? We're going to make hot dogs. But you guys can vote on the other two things that we're going to include. Whatever you would like. <clears throat> Go 
cream, baked potato, and lasagna. Let's Exclamation, hire me in chat to join the chef squad. The Yamali chef squad. Do the thing. Exclamation, hire me if you would like to join us. Oh dear. I feel like my voice is getting smoother, but my throat is getting more sore. You know, you know, it's it's weird. You lose that crackly quality after a while, but it still hurts like more. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You and me, Kay. Ship up and ship out. You and me. Kay and the bot squad. Indeed. Indeed. Alright, let's go. The fuck is a P dog? You can make one. I don't know what the PDG is, but do it and let's figure out what it is. So, what, what, pork? Hot pork dog. Good. Brilliant. Service, please, Kay. What? Pasta, please. Oh, you just missed out on being on trash duty. Well done. Please, Kay. Way to go. <clears throat> when everything gets ready at the same time. Mmm, tasty. Um. Ah, uh, all right. They're all. Hang on. I'm gonna Quite probably nice. get you on service because it's more fun than something I don't actually need. There we go. Please, Kay. Go, squad, go. Day complete. Let's wrap it up, squad. And service for Kay. Get the bot out the way so that you can actually do something. Uh, there you go. Pork. I reckon it might be pork, yeah. 
Squatch. Oh, Squatch. Yeah, interesting. Ugh. Perfect day. Wonderful Excuse work, me. Squad. A new food upgrade. Oh, no. all right. Now, squad. Are we upgrading pasta or sandwich? Pasta or sandwich? I am curious to see what the third type of pasta is. Third type of bread, I'm assuming, is just going to be like a bread roll rather than a piece of bread, you know? But we'll see. Pasta in lost last time. Correct. You're doing great. Look, I'm... <sighs> this is... It's a time. I'm having a time. I'm having a time. I'm curious to see what the third type of pasta is going to be. I kind of just want to finish the game, just, you know, but we'll see. I don't know if my throat will make it love. <laughs> pasta wins it. Alrighty. What we cook today, squad? Gonna make pasta. Vote for what? Wait. That one doesn't say Max. What do you guys want? What else do you want on the menu? Why does pasta only say four? Uh, uh, I'd say this is a lot easier than Overcooked. Personally, it is made by the same people though. No, Cook, Serve, Delicious. It's the same people, sorry, my bad. Potato and chicken sandwich! Exclamation, hire me. Exclamation, hire me. If you would like to join the chef squad. Um, but yeah, it's, um... Overcooked has different types of challenges. In this thing, everyone, you kind of, like, you've got a head person and they're assigned a job and then you go do that. Whereas Overcooked, because there are so few of you and so many things that need doing, you kind of need to, like, take a bit of responsibility and choose things to do yourself that you can see need doing and stuff. Like, it's, yeah. Um, yeah it's, a, it's, it's a different type of challenge, I think. Um, Apparently pasta keeps going, yeah. More autonomy and two tricks yet. More autonomy, and yeah, yeah. This there's a, there's more of a I feel like there's more of a time crunch, but there's more outside variables that you can't necessarily control. Let's things like your own latency yeah. and, and all that kind of stuff. Um, where overcooked is a little more. Um, it's random in-game things that screw you over, rather than, um, stuff like that. Uh, customize if you'd like, 2K. To my skin. Ah, oh, dear. Alright. Let go. Day 37 out of 55, we're getting there. Alright. Uh... It's bow tie pasta. Make us some bow tie pasta, okay? Service, please. K. Way to go. I'm sorry, Kay. <laughs> Trash, please. Go squat. Okay. Yes. 
We should have to do the sink. Okay, if you ha if you have to like, if you have to do like either the dishes or take the trash out. If you tell me the answer now, then it's gonna get lost in, te in text. But I would love to know which of the preferred chores, like which of the chores is preferred to you. Service, please, K. So imagine that everyone would have like their preferred chores. Like, I mean, you don't necessarily enjoy any of them, but maybe you enjoy one slightly more than the other kind of thing. No. What? Um, could I get some bow tie pasta? F no, wait. Pasta, regular pasta from UK. Here we go. Um. Oh, cancel with one C in the middle. <laughs> there we go. Sorry. I just, I went to put you there and then I'm like, wait, the bot chose to do bow tie pasta. Oops. It's entirely my bad. That's my bad. Yes, K and five bots. It's look, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. It's it's a bit kind of brain scattering, but uh, I'm I'm figuring it out. I'm go I got a bit of a pattern flowing. Bit of a pattern flowing. But yeah, so if 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 y'all had to pick between um if you had to pick between trash or dishes. Like taking out the trash or doing the dishes, what like what would you prefer to do as an individual? A new food upgrade. Oh, no, also no. lasagna or baked potato to upgrade. Trash is downstairs. General base is probably trash because it's quicker. Trash hundred percent. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, I probably prefer trash as well, just because like trash can make such a big difference to like how a place feels and, and all that kind of stuff and it is quicker and also um my nails get super damaged if i actually like hand wash dishes um because they like uh fingernails absorb water and when they absorb water they get weaker and all that kind of stuff and because mine are long and maintained and stuff um there's a far more a far higher likelihood of damage if i get if i soak them in water for too long especially warm water but when we do have um, dishes to be hand washed, usually uh, Jas will wash them and I'll dry them and put them away. That way, at least we're doing it together and we're, you know, getting through it faster and stuff. And then you don't have clean dishes sitting on the bench for three goddamn days while they're drying. Yeah. Use trash is generally easier. Fair. Yeah. Yeah. Of course. I should say, I'm so this is what I had to have dishwasher, so maybe I'd stack that. Yeah, we've uh, we've still got a handful, like uh, a few bits and pieces that aren't dishwasher safe, um, or they are dishwasher safe, but the dishwasher just can't wash them properly, and you get like dirty stuff, so, like like drink bottles and stuff like that. They don't wash all the way up properly, um, which is why I've got the the bottle brush um, that Ms. Aaron bought from, from my wish list for me, which has been such a godsend. Holy cow, it cleans so well, like so so well. Um, because yeah, like I if I if I eat off dirty dishes or drink out of dirty cups and stuff, especially cups with drinks, like if there's gunk on the bottom of it, even if you can only barely see it, but then it the whatever's the the drink in the cup soaks into it and lifts it up off the glass and then I drink it, it can make me exceptionally sick. Uh, just because everything else, all the other comorbidities I've got going on, so stuff has to be clean. Um, so if we've got to put like every so often, the dishwasher won't clean the cups properly. Uh, so we'll have to go through and hand wash those just because it's not worth getting sick. Um, most people are fine. They're just like, oh, there's a bit of a smudge there. It's fine. Let's let's just go on and whatever. Um, but there are some of us who can't, unfortunately. So, um, yeah. Anyway. Um, start next What's day. Good today? 
I want to see. Look, this is gone. This isn't max yet either. We didn't get a new baked potato when we upgraded it last time, so I wonder what this will do. Through the dying situation, love well, mostly hand wash because the dishwasher isn't great. You should throw wishless skip myself. The bottle cleaner, oh, it's so good, hey. It's a really, really good one. Like legit, really, really good. Um But yeah, uh We just we don't have I mean we've got we've got a bit of bench space, but not like tons. Um and having dishes just kind of sitting out and stuff just it really it irritates me. I've one of the things I've noticed quite a bit over the last few months is that um, clutter affects me more than I thought it did. Um, so clutter in and around the place just it it fucks me up. It drains me and it exhausts me and it just yeah. So we've uh, we've implemented a bit of a, a cleaning and tidying schedule just so every so often particular areas of the house just get a quick once over, just put some things away, that kind of thing. And my mental health has massively improved just just by putting shit away, and not leaving it all over the fucking place. So yeah, it's um it's a huge difference, a huge huge difference. Um, but yeah, it's uh it takes effort to maintain. Um, now has a gift rank. Oh, does it? <laughs> oh wow, that's a bit interesting. Does it, like how? Does it like show how much people have been spending and stuff? Or is that, I feel like that would be like a little too, I don't know. Um, where's my wish list button? Oh wow. Oh, there you go. Oh, that's super cute. That's cute. That's super adorable. So it doesn't, it doesn't have like... It doesn't have like the amount that people have spent and so that's good because I don't want to like, that's... It's cute though, I like that. So you could like put up your, your display pictures and stuff if you wanted to. That's adorable. Aww. That's kind of nice. All right. Begin nice hiring. Story. Begin hiring. Larry lives in Australia. Sinks is the bottom part of a U-shaped kitchen situation. Gotcha. Interesting things in the way. Cats have less to play with at night. Better sleep for everyone. I like that. I like that. I like it doesn't show the amount though. Yeah, me too, me too. Like, I mean, I, I imagine that having the amount there might be a, a nice little thing for some people who like, who, especially for people who are super competitive, who know, who want to know what they have to spend to, to get to the next rank or whatever. Um, but I also think it's, I don't know, it's a bit, I don't know, maybe a bit much. Just sort of, it could also expose people's financial situations and stuff, which isn't necessarily the nicest thing to do. Um, yeah, I don't know. But I, I like that's cute. That's a little acknowledgement to say, you know, these are people who have who have supported and helped out and, and all that kind of stuff. That's it's a nice little a nice little nod there. Um, the chef, indeed, it's meaty. Sheep up and he is a goat surprises me a little cute though. So the goat was talking. We we're talking about a sacrificial goat um, to our and Jesus, so I could get the heartbreaker. Uh, and the ears, the bunny ears, are like the Santa hat for chair. Um, for Easter slash Noble Garden. It's a plush goat. It's not a real goat, but it was a, a stand-in sacrificial goat to, yeah. <laughs> I would not actually stab the plushie. I just have it there as, you know, representative of a potential sacrificial goat. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go. But yeah, my pop socket died. <laughs> That's why there's a million and one of those there. Um, Kay, could I get some pasta from you? And Meaty, could I get a spud from you, please? But yeah, my um my my Pax pop socket completely busted. Like completely and entirely. Um, it's got a uh like split in that, yeah, you can Yep, yeah, it's busted. <laughs> so uh mm. 
I, I fell down a hole while high on painkillers on Amazon, looking at um, looking at uh, spinach pasta for K, uh, <laughs> looking at pop sockets, and uh, I, yeah. So there's a few on there now because I couldn't. Yep, I couldn't. Good job. On the service, please, Meaty. <clears throat> um, you going all right, Kay? Perfect. All right, just got in there. Um, a spud, a spud from K, please. And service for Meaty. Perfect. Should I have pasta from a botch? A couple of these. Ah, oh, dishes. Where's me? Oh, Meaty's with Okay, cool. I was like, crap! Where did I put in person? Nice. K on service, please. And a spud from Meaty, please. Tasty. I am grateful. Ah, oh, Desia, thank you very much for the replacement pop socket. Go much spot. appreciated. Mm, fuck, what am I doing? Okay, good. Yep, all right, we're good, nice. we're good, we're good. Maybe. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Did you know? Fun facts. Uh, spud from you, please, Kay. Fun fact, um, official actual pop socket branded pop sockets. Um, you can, like, take off the pretty bit. Excellent. And replace it with another pop socket branded pretty bit. Uh, what is this? Bowtie pasta, please, from you, Meaty. Okay, complete. Let's wrap it up, squad. So you can, like, so you don't have to unstick them and restick them and all that kind of, you can just, like, twist and take off the thing and put a new pretty one on if the sticky thing is still working just fine, which yeah. I think is super cool. Which is also why I didn't just pick one, because I thought, ah, fuck it. Why not? But yes, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Lord knows I need it. The number of times I've dropped my phone on my face in the last couple days. <laughs> Lying in bed, trying to browse shit because I'm too dizzy to sit upright. Uh, Kay, you're going to be on service in just a moment. Hey, there we go. Um... Literally all the time. Yeah, which is why I think it broke. But I mean, hey, two years is not bad to, for that to have lasted. Like, two f over two years before it started splitting. Uh, it started splitting and it wouldn't stay popped out. And then eventually it, it tore, like the day after surgery, it tore completely. Um, and yeah, but it's, that's super funky. Sense of feature. It is, right? It's super funky. And you can even buy ones that don't come with the sticky base so that like, you're just getting the top bit so that you can just sort of, yeah, it's funky. It's cool. Yay, we did a win. Good job, you guys. Nothing Good job. Right, oh, squad? fuck. Thank you, Sylvia. Pardon me. Um, yes, but it also, like, it looks like shit. All the color is gone from it. And it's scratched to hell. So I don't know, maybe. Maybe. I have a habit of keeping ridiculously useless stuff that is literally trash because it has some sentimental value to it. Uh, and I need to stop doing that. I need to stop hoarding. I mean, I don't, I don't, okay. There's there's hoarding, like the people you see on the TV shows and stuff like that. And then there's hoarding of just like, hang on to things like, hey, you know, I might use this at some point. Um, I'm not. It's, it's, it's useless. Um, I was reading a, a subreddit the other day, I can't remember, it was like an organizational one or a decluttering one or something, and they were talking about that they had this habit that they always, um... What should we cook today, squad? 
Uh, good question. What should we cook today, squad? Salad. We haven't cooked salad in a while. Um, they they always they were in this habit of like they'd hold on to stuff because it will be useful one day. I'll have a use for that, and then if I've thrown it out, I'll have to go buy another one or whatever. And the, the time finally came. It had been like five years that they'd been holding on to this thing, and they finally needed it, but they couldn't find it in all their storage shit because they'd held on to too much shit that they were going to use eventually one day. They could, so they ended up having to buy something. They had to buy another one because they couldn't find the original one that they hadn't tossed away in the first place. And that really just was kind of like, yep, <laughs> yep. So yeah, I need to, I need to not hold on to shit when I just don't need it. <clears throat> mm. Which was the stuff I've not touched in little years? I need to get rid of. Yep, yep. Soup and pasta, yay! How do you like the partner pasta get? Um, they don't. It's not a partner pass. Um, Pax have never done partner passes. They do media passes. Um, so there, like, there will be, there will be some partners, like Twitch partners, who will get media passes to Pax. However, there are specific conditions on getting a media pass. There always has been. It's not just be a partner. It's like you have to actually be involved in the production of Pax somehow. So if you're like on a, uh, if you're on a panel, or if you're part of a booth you like you're helping a game developer put on a booth by being a demo like a demo person for their game or whatever um or that or you're producing content on the floor for packs not just for your own channel all this kind of stuff so there's um yeah there are there are very specific or you know you're producing you're writing an article for a local game magazine that's that's the kind of yeah you you need to actually be a part of the media um to be able to get a media pass um and so yeah i'll be applying for one uh but We'll see. <laughs> like, I'm still pretty. I'm pretty. I'm still pretty small fry compared to a lot of the Australian um, bigger streamers and stuff. So, yeah. Um. Yep. It's not just that easy. Uh, I will, however, be able to get access to the partner booth, which will be nice. Uh, if they actually have one this year, not sure if they will or not. Um. Everything's all still very much up in the air. Like. Even Twitch themselves have recommended that yes, there is a Paxos. We recommend you buy a ticket. Um, because if you do not get a media pass, you will not be able to buy a ticket. Because by then, by the time they do talk about media passes, tickets have usually sold out. So they, they recommend that you buy a ticket because if you don't get a partner pass, if you don't get a media pass, you'll be shit out of luck. Um, so yeah, I bought. Got two day passes, uh, two three day passes, um, and then if I do manage to get myself a media pass and am involved somehow in the production of the whole thing, uh, then I'll get a refund on my ticket. Uh, to say another day, what memorabilia items you wanted with that boy's cremation? We saw these cute paw print inks or plaster molds. I said it would just sit on a shelf. Let's get the urn and pendants. First time I've ever chosen the not hoarder choice. That's really good. Good on you, meaty. Good on you. And pendant is something that you actually like. You wear. And I mean, like, the paw print inks and plaster and stuff, you can always, like, they're, they're things that can be hung on a wall and stuff, but I don't have a whole lot of stuff on my walls, mostly because it's a rental, but also because, like, I just, I'm not great at, you know, like, putting together a collection of stuff to put on the wall. Um, but yeah, like, a pendant is a, it's a piece of jewellery, like, you'll, and yeah, like, that can, it can even become an heirloom, things like that, you know. Um... But yeah, I think that's a really beautiful choice. It's about not launches of fairly decent credentials. Blizzard doesn't have that much of a thing in Australia, though. Uh, hey, Lucky. Hello. Yeah, Blizzard doesn't have a very strong presence in Australia. They, they, it's growing, but it's um, it's not huge. Uh, last PAX was the first PAX Blizzard actually came to, uh, in terms of Australia. Um, so, yeah, it's... Uh, and even then, they had like a panel and a booth that was unmanned for most of the three days. Um, so yeah, it wasn't a... Uh... Okay, begin hiring. Cool, <clears throat> yeah, I don't have any more drink left. <laughs> I'll have to go grab one. I wish my necklace. Stop carrying his clothes in my pocket everywhere. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan! Exclamation hire me to join us. To join the chef squad. Oh. Excuse me. Mm. 
Mm, you should join us, Lucky. Absolutely. Jump into the kitchen with us. A lot of fun. Many funs. This is a tutorial video. I can show you the tutorial video if you want. Like, after the hiring thing. You still have to put hire me into chat, though. Exclamation hire me to join. And then I'll show you the video. Yas, Em. Yas. Customization time. Suit up and head out. There you go. Customizations, and then I'll show you all the video. Watching from it, totally fine. Not a worry. Then we might outnumber the bots, maybe. Maybe. I'm gonna play the tutorial just for it because I know there's a few people in here who haven't played yet. So here we go. Hi, I'm one of Julia and welcome to Chef Squad. In Chef Squad, players work together to run a restaurant. The streamer plays as the head chef and chat plays as chefs in the kitchen. Finish the day to unlock new foods, upgrades, and challenges. Oh, <gasps> sandwich! The kitchen has a number of stations based on what's on the menu. Each station can prepare specific ingredients. When the day starts, the streamer should drag a chef from the chef pool onto a station and tell that player what to do. April, let's do some hot dogs. Please, regular, and Molly, let's do some vegan hot dogs. If you're unsure what to make, type exclamation point which one, and the streamer can help you out. When you're on a station, type the ingredient to select it and then follow the instructions that pop up to finish preparing it. Once you've finished, the ingredient will be added to the inventory and your chef will be placed back into the chef pool. If Twitch chat prevents you from typing the key phrase, try typing any word after the command to bypass the filter. Should a player need to be kicked at any time for being AFK, the streamer can right click that chef and do so. Orders will come in on the right side and will have specific ingredients needed to make them. Everyone needs to work together to make ingredients for each order. A check mark on the ingredient indicates it's been made and is ready to go. And a clock indicates an ingredient is currently being made. Focus on making ingredients without these symbols and ingredients with zero inventory. Once the order is ready, it will have a large check mark next to it. The streamer should place a chef on a final order station near the top of the screen to finalize an order and send it out to the customer. If an order runs off the screen, it becomes a bad order. Get too many bad orders and your day is over. No! I believe in the power of the squad and I know we can all do it together. Good luck, chefs. There you go. Pretty simple. Pretty straightforward. Let us begin. Alrighty. Uh, Kay, if I could get you on some broth, meaty, I'll get some pasta. And Zem, I'll get some salad. Whatever that tho, I don't know what tho stands for, but that's fine. Go with that one. Thou toss. I'm curious as to what it actually tries to it's trying to be. Oh, it's like Thousand Island. Okay, gotcha. So what you're prepping is actually a salad with the dressing. Zem, you're on uh, order prep. So up the top. Work and service. Uh, and K, I'll get you on tomato. Okay. Uh, meaty, I'll get you on pepper. Capsicum. Squad goals. Capsicum. Uh, and K on some tomato. And them on the trash. Tasty. Okay, on service. And meaty on spinach pasta. Go squat. 
Uh, salad, please, K. Some green broth from Zim. on service and meaty on pasta regular pasta what uh, bow tie pasta please K uh, salad please Zim Awesome. We got there. Perfect day. Wonderful mm. work, squad. A new food. Unlocks. All right. Do we want to uh, upgrade salad or sandwich? Vote now in chat with your exclamations. Any lamb. Uh, hey, Annex, yes, you can't join in the middle of a round, though, and as you can probably tell, I can't, like, because I'm trying to do stuff and everyone's typing in chat, I can't pay attention to chat. Um, I, this is why I check after each round. But yep, there's a point at the game that you type in to join the, the squad, and that is when you can join us. Yes. Um... Alrighty. Ah, so is that everyone voting? Streamers playing it? Yeah, I think it's because uh, a lot of streamers tend to focus on specific games. Um, and when they change to something like this, like this is about a third of the usual viewers I sit at. And so when you have this many, like when your viewer base shrinks this much, you don't get as many chefs in and you can't do much because the bots are a pain in the ass to try to manage. So, <laughs> um, yeah, it's a it's a bit of a thing. What should um, we all right. So, what do we end up upgrading? Was the was it the sandwich? Yes. And it says level four as well. Okay. Vote for what else you would like to put on the menu. Choose what you would like on the menu by using the little tags on the things. Throw in your votes now. Sandwich, hot dogs, and salad. Interesting. To squad up. Exclamation hire me to join the squad. Starting to get a bit um, mildly lightheaded. <laughs> uh, this is probably the longest I've been sitting upright for uh, for about a week now. So uh, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely starting to feel it. We're going alright though. We're going alright. Just do what I can. Let's suit up and head out. 
Customize your characters if you so desire. Um, alrighty. Let's go. You need to be improving day by day. I am. I am. I'm getting there. My throat still hurts, and I'm still a little bit kind of woozy. But uh, overall, doing pretty good. Thank you for asking. I hope that you're doing well as well. Okay. Here we go. K, a hot dog, please. Annex, a salad. Meaty on white bread. Uh, Zem, I'll get a vegan hot dog. And I'll put the bots on the. Okay, I'll grab an onion from you. And Axe, I'll get you on service. This guy has a second. Uh, Zem on capsicum, on pepper. This one, the PEP. on tomato, meaty on, uh, actually on hot dog, please, and Anax, I'll get you on wheat bread. Good job. Zem on service. Uh, K on salad. Zem on the sink. Uh, Anax on service. And K on ham, please. So met. I think it's meat. No, met, whatever. <laughs> And meaty on salad, please. Sam on service. Yum. An axe on trash. A K on white bread. Zem on service. Day complete. Let's wrap it up, squad. <sighs> Missed the salad. Um. Excellent. And media on service. And that should be that. Unlocked the last one. We unlocked nachos. What should we cook today, squad? Um. Yeah, let's try the nachos. Vote for what you would like to cook this day. Excuse me. I need to see 
got you. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Vote for what else you would like to put on the menu. It's all good. It's all good. Right, pasta, steak, and nachos. It's a very interesting restaurant, go, if squad. I do say so myself. <laughs> Exclamation, hire me. Should join the squad. <sighs> Exclamation, hire me. I'm up to 25 chefs. A lot of people. Just happy town. I personally would not. Uh, I would. I would absolutely skip the nachos. It'd be questionable on the steak at this point. The pasta would be okay if I can get them to massively overcook it though. It's just I need soft food. <laughs> oh man, I'm fine. Everything's fine. Last chance! Exclamation! Hire me to join. This is the word. Sean heading to bed? Totally fine. Totally fine. Up and head Hope up. you've enjoyed playing. Make the last round a good one, eh? Let's smash it. We'll do all the things. Oh man, I think I'm gonna pass out. Hmm. <clears throat> this might have to be my last one as well. We'll see how I feel afterwards. Hey. It's been fun though. It's been really fun. Okay, let's go. Hey, with some pasta, Zem with a T-bone, Anax with some chips. Uh, Meaty, I'll get you on spinach pasta, please. And thank you all. This is one of the steaks I didn't pick here, it's fine. Uh, K on some capsicum, please. Tasty. Um, Anax, could I get you on uh, a New York strip? Y-S. Zem on service. A on service. E.T. on chips. on service. Okay on service. Uh, an axe on chips. Go squad. Okay on service. BT on a T-bone. <clears throat> and thank you all. Uh, Annex on service. Yes. K on bowtie, please. Bowtie pasta. Uh, and Zim on tomato. on a ribeye. Disgusting. Stay complete. Let's wrap it up. 
one. Oh no, Spud. I'm on service. But we're good. Squad ghouls. We missed three, but we didn't fail. Another day completed. <laughs> oh, A new board upgrade. All right, so vote for your upgrade. Do we want to upgrade nachos to three or salad to four? Up to you guys. So got 15 seconds to vote. Nachos or salad? Which one would you like to upgrade? Too many exclamations. Yeah. You'll just use one exclamation, Zem. That's okay. I think salad would have won anyway, because it's the first one to get to three votes. Um, cool. So I'm actually going to save and quit there. Um, because I'm starting to... Like my throat was getting better and now it's starting to feel worse and I'm also starting to get a little lightheaded and dizzy and stuff like that so I think the best uh, course of action for me is going to be to lie the fuck down uh, but that being said I've just realized I've got to oh, okay that button's not gonna work um we've got a stream tomorrow and we've also got a stream on Wednesday and that's it for March and I forgot to do the channel point goals Friday and today. So we're going to do two one day goals, which is going to freak everybody out, but that's okay. So we'll have one goal up on Monday and one goal up on Wednesday. Um, and you can drop in as many points as you can manage and we'll see how we go. Rest up more? Yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, I need to be able to get to my surgeon, uh, surgeon's offices tomorrow and stuff as well. So I need to make sure I'm like well rested for that as well. So yeah. But yeah, so I'm going to go and have a rest, and I hope that you guys have had a wonderful time. I, I, this is why I thought like it might be fun to just do a short stream of Chef Squad, just as I ease back into my, my usual streaming pattern, what with all the, the side effects and the, the surgery and all that kind of fun stuff. Um, and we'll just uh, see how we go. Um, but I'm very much looking forward to... Very much looking forward to tomorrow. Uh, Mount Fun Monday. Back to some sense of normalcy. Some sense. Not like too much, but something. Um, yeah, I hope you join me for that. I am as yet undecided on whether I will do my usual mount farming or if I will go and do uh, Xerath Mortis mount farming. Because it doesn't really feel like mount farming, but at the same time it kind of does. It's, I don't know, it's a little bit, it's interesting. If we can get a group together and farm for Genesis Moats or something. I don't know. Um. Yeah. Just one time. Oh, you're very welcome. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. Well, that's, I'm thinking I might go back and do the old stuff. Cause yeah, I don't know. I feel like I'm closer to a lot of those than I am to some of the ZM ones. But, yeah. We do islands. Well, if we do the old stuff, we'll end up at islands to see if that's kind of the um, here we go. Let us do a raid. Go, grab your copy-paste. If you don't have the Fiamma Hype Be Note, either because you are not subscribed or because you haven't unlocked it with your channel points, both of which are totally okay. 
Um, you can still copy and paste the whole message, delete the Fiamma hype, pop in your favorite happy hypey celebratory emote and drop it into Purse's chat when we get there. Purse is a lovely streamer, uh, does mostly World of Warcraft, um, and she's just really, really lovely. So I hope that you'll join me in saying hello to her before I dip and pass out. <laughs> um, and take care of yourselves, be nice to each other, and I will see you tomorrow for Mount Farm Monday. See you then.